All right, this video is on the air conditioner. This uh, fat fish, it's the second time I'm using it for a living room, social room, kitchen, dining room, uh, get out of the weather room, and I, I wanted to put an air conditioner in here. This is zero breeze. I thought I just backed it up to the window. Go inside and check it out. But you got the inlet. That's the outlet right there. That's air coming out of the and then the air going in, so this is like your, your thing that would be outside, your, your vacuum. Drain tube is right here. i got to get a new tube, that one's kinking. And then the power supply, which I could run off my jack rig. Or zero breeze cells of battery that goes with it. It's a great little air conditioner. <coughs> if we were camping during the summertime, I would probably need a better overtop to give more shade. Because that sun was beating down on here. That air conditioner would not be enough to come out the sun. But I think with the proper shade over this tent, it'll work. This top right here is just a scrap piece I had. Had some reflective, some shading ability. There's no anything. Just give me a little buffer. But during the summertime, we're going to have to do a little bit better than that. Let's go inside and take a look. Alright, on the inside here, I don't have my thermometers out. It's just keeping up with the outside. Um, since we're in an enclosed space, the sun's going to warm it up, but then the air conditioner is balancing it out. Uh, with the air conditioner set up on a table, lined up with the window, and we have right now. 58 degree air going out of the, the outlet. So this air gets pulled in here, goes through the coil, gets blown back out here, and the thermometer says it's 58 degree air coming out of here, which is just keeping up with this uh, space underneath the sun right now. Okay, next bed. Get a fan helping with the circulation. A chair and our two tables. It's working out good. Loving it. 